Hey, what's going on, everybody? Exhausted Gamer here, bringing you a special video today. I'm going to be bringing you a video um, courtesy of SlickWraps.com. They were kind enough to send me a skin and a screen protector for my Pebble Steel watch. So I'm going to apply that today and show you, show you guys how that works. Um, the main reason why, you know, first and foremost, I agreed to do this video is because I was looking for looking for uh, something to apply to to my device that would get rid of this right here the word pebble on the face of my device you know this is an excellent well built device and it serves me well and it does everything I want it to do but this right here to some people is an eyesore so and, and I'm being one of those people so I wanted to go ahead and um, and go ahead and share this product with you all and let you let and show you all you know how great it can look on the device yet still maintaining the quality of you know the basically the stock quality of the device when you first get it so right now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and start the application process right here in this in this pouch right here you get the screen protector well you get the skin for the, the skin to go around the bezel of the device here it is right here the skin and then they send you also two screen protectors to put in put inside the device I think one might also apply to the back as well I'm not sure and then you have a slick wraps have a slick wraps uh, microfiber cloth that they send you to help you clean your device before you start the application as you can see slickwraps.com embroidered into the cloth so let's go ahead and get this uh, application process started so the first thing you really want to do obviously when you're installing any type of screen protector or skin is that you want to go ahead and clean the device and get it ready to go so let's go ahead and wipe that off and get everything clean off and just try to make sure we don't have any fingerprints or dirt on the device alright I think we look good right there we'll get a little bit off right here alright now first and foremost basically based off of common sense um, I'm going to go ahead and apply the skin first. So we're going to go ahead and get everything lined up and get that in place also. So there's probably plenty of ways you can do this. I'm doing this with the most, you know, common knowledge way possible. So the first thing I'm going to do is try to get my front tip, the front piece of it off. and now I'm going to go ahead and place it on the front edge of the device yeah you gotta be real real careful when you're doing this gotta line up everything perfectly so now I got everything pretty much lined up the way I wanted to let me see yep it's lined up so I'm gonna go ahead and get everything applied down go ahead and apply it it's it's pretty easy to remove it if you need to and come back and adjust it but I recommend that you get it perfectly seated in there just let it be so Smooth it down real quick. As you can see, I might have something under there. I'm not sure if something got stuck, but it's not that bad. All right, so now we have this first process, this first part of the process done. Let's go ahead and try to smooth this corner out. All right, cool. We have this nice and slick. Let's go ahead and wipe it again. Just make sure we didn't get any fingerprints on the screen. 
as you can see right here you will see when I like turn it on there's a little hole right here so you can see the notification light on it so alright now on to the screen protector I'm gonna go ahead and peel this off real quick and I'm gonna do the same thing I did with same thing I did with the skin so I'm gonna peel the front edges off so I can apply it on there without placing my fingertips on it so stand up for this one all right let me just go ahead and get it inside that that square right there and once you basically get it lined up you can just go ahead and hold it down and apply the rest as you see how that went but it's still landed in the square perfectly and you just go ahead and smooth it out get the air bubbles out push the bubbles out and just get it cleared off and everything see if we can get that last bubble out Hold on a second. Oh, well, I'm going to use this Facebook right here. So go ahead and push that bubble out. see how we look in here all right I'm still trying to work this bubble out right here on the edge I'm trying to get that pushed down a little bit I should push out eventually there it go all right there we go right there looking good probably gonna take a little bit of working with it and getting making sure you just get it down in there and everything like that but it's coming out it came out pretty good so as you can see I'm gonna turn my device back on pebble and it's not too bad you are still gonna have to probably work it out a little bit and get the air pockets off the um, out of the edge of the screen but pretty much other than that it's pretty it's, it's good to go application is pretty simple I try to do my best for you all and give you all a straight up application process but it's, it's it's not that bad it's not that bad it's going to take a little bit of work with like any screen protector if you want the optimal results but this is actually good to go so I actually you know you know, as far as using this right here, I want to say you got to have a steady hand and, you know, probably for the sake of the video, I'm not going to sit up here and take you all through this whole process of me trying to make sure everything is perfect and fine, but it's not, it's not that bad of, of a, an accessory, you know, if you need something and you want to just make your accessory look a little bit different and everything like that, so... You can change through, let me see, watch faces, boom, boom, boom. So you can change through the watch faces and stuff like that, but it's actually good to go, not that bad, so. Um, you know, just go on the slickwraps.com, check out their products. They have plenty of products out there. They just have an actual screen protector for this as well. And, um... I highly, highly, you know, recommend just checking them out. Great prices, great prices. This right here retail, I think, runs about about seven bucks or so. 
and you get this and it comes with a screen protector and everything on it as well so and if not if you just want the skin you can easily just put the skin on here and just rock it with you know without the screen protecting and just have the skin going around the bezel and everything like that but you know definitely definitely a niche product you know not a niche product but it's a definitely a good product to have if you want to you know protect your device let's see let's make sure I got this whole lined up well on the side yep so I got the LED charger hole lined up pretty well so this is going to take a little bit to working out the bubbles and the kinks but after you get everything smoothed out and clean you will definitely like the finish it puts on your product and the extra protection you have on your front face as well especially for people that are constantly banging their watch on you know on the corner on the wall on the door just you know kinda like you know that happens all the time I got a few few little dings here and there but it's nothing noticeable but it just happens with your everyday usage and stuff like that so all right, everybody, it's been Exhausted Gamer here bringing you this special review of the, of the Slick Wraps Pebble Skin. Y'all check out slickwraps.com and let them know what you think of your product and actually pick up a couple things. I see they have iPod, you know, iPod and MP3 skins, iPad, Kindle, Kindle skins, computer skins, probably for laptops, gaming, Pebble wa watches as you see here. This is for the Pebble Steel and the first generation pebble TV devices and other cool stuff that you probably see on their site as well so whatever whatever you know whatever fits you know the script for you you can go in there and check out their prices pretty good stuff I've seen some stuff for the iPhone 5s and everything so it's a pretty well made thing so alright everybody exhausted gamer here y'all take care peace Bye.